Got him a, got a baby Buddha. Got a Hulu girl. This is style. Style. Got a little Hulu lady. Hulu dancer. Look at the Pope waving at you. Hey YouTube, Camper Van Kevin here. Well today, I'm at the Home Depot in Boise, Idaho. What am I doing here? I got problems. Dash AC is doing great. Just put on 50, 60 miles, run it hours, hour or two. It's doing great. That roof AC, where's it at? That roof AC, drawing way too many amps to run. I think the compressor's locking down. <laughs> if it ain't one thing, it's 10 others. I hadn't ordered my mini split yet. I hadn't ordered it. And to add insult to injury, my little portable unit, my little um, high sense 200 square foot unit that I bought for the ProMaster that I got at Lowe's, <laughs> it was running just fine. Then it went up to 3,800 watts, boom, overload, tripped everything off. I have no AC. It's hot. So I'm going to go to the Home Depot. I'm going to buy me a window unit. I'm going to get the most efficient one that I can find. It cuts off once it's done cooling. The highest sear. All that jazz. I'll either be a 6,000 or an 8,000 BTU. And uh, then I'll just figure it out from there. I got to have, I got to, I got to keep these babies cool. And I'm a big fan of staying comfortable too. We just pulled, we just pulled in. We went and got some propane. Um, there's a uh, RV dealership here offering uh, 99 cent propane. So we took full advantage of it. Took $12 to fill my propane tank. Martini, <laughs> excuse you, excuse you, baby. You're a mess. This RV is a mess. We sat there at that uh, uh, repair shop for days. I got a sweet and I got a mop. So but there's the baby May Maze with a piece of popcorn on the floor. But when I pulled in here, I spotted me a, a Volkswagen van convertible. So I may go up and look at it. Then I'm going to get a, a cart and come back and get the babies. So, but I'm going to run up there before. Please don't get in it. Please don't get in it. Please don't get in it. Aha, good, he kept walking. So we're gonna go up. And we're gonna look at this right I can't, can't point, we're zoomed. Get back. Get back. We're gonna look at it. I'll come back and get the babies. I could probably run that roof AC for a little bit, but I don't want to hurt my inverter. And I sure don't want to cause a fire. It's one of those things. Oh, it's nice. Now, I want to put a disclaimer in. I was eating popcorn right before I made this video. And uh, so if I had kernels in my teeth, these are very, very highly sought after bugs of uh, buses. Call it, call it bug one more time. Teton, Santa Cruz, Yellowstone. This baby's used. It's got a little, little stove top in it. Look at that rack up there. We got wind. We got wind. Got him a, got a baby Buddha. Got a Hulu girl. This is style. Style. Got a little Hulu lady. Hulu dancer. Look at the Pope waving at you. Ooh. 
Look at her, look at her, look at her. Ooh. Very highly sought after windows. I can't get over that poke. Let's look at him again. Isn't that fun? The Buddha's drinking coffee and on a cell phone. His body's straight. I give the paint a 9 out of 10. So he's got him a... Probably one side's a sink, one side's a burner. Got a little store, a table that stows out of the way. Hand coop tires. It'll be fun to play with for a little while. Then all the way to Asheville. something else I hope you all enjoyed that as much as me mm, that's fun oh that's fun if we got wind noise I apologize you know somebody as far along as I am with this stuff ought to keep a microphone and a muff in his pocket but I don't. Let's look at that dash one more time. Mm. Good job. All right, let me get a buggy, go back and get these babies. Let the babies out to potty right quick. We'll put this take this rug with us and put it watch out baby put it in the floor here so the screen don't hurt the baby's feet always so eager tucker tell you what when i got him he, he, he is a good dog but boy he sure was hard to <laughs> he was hard to train and i, I think the problem was I used to take baby May May and Martini to work and I made him stay at home and I think he was rebelling come to find out when we got out on the road that's what when I when I started in, including him all the time he's just got better and better and better and better and he's learned me what I expect and I've learned him what, what he wants and what he's capable of. And Tucker's made the best dog, but once we got out on the road, the one that acted best at home, this this monkey right here, she's been the one that's given me the most trouble. So, the everything's everything's turned. But I got three good dogs. And I've got, I've got to be a better owner and a better daddy to them, I think. And baby May May, she don't care. She, she's just in for the ride. But I think she gets tired of traveling, honestly. Because whenever we visit somewhere, she really likes to stay in one place and stay there with them. We got it all worked out now, don't we, Tucker? Man, I love you. I love you, Daddy. I love you too, Tuck. You're a good boy. You're a good boy. Look at that, look at that toothy grin. Wouldn't take $10 million for you. Or a nickel. Yorkies are crazy smart and can be crazy stubborn. They pout, they act out, and you got to be firm with them. But uh, we're we're one happy wolf pack. We got it all figured out now. <laughs>
Don't, don't make me have to choose. I couldn't choose between you if I had to. But now everybody's got a place to put their feet. Let's go in and get an air conditioner, okay? Y'all ready? Right. I'm, I'm ready. I'm ready. Let's get out of here. All right. Here we go. I would have got one with a, 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 a noisy wheel. When we go by this van up here, y'all need to look at it, okay? Pretty thing. What a treat. After walking around half the store, looks like I may have found them. Toshiba, I've been looking online. LG. I don't see any other brands right now. I'm going to see what I can find. I've got the best babies. Y'all are doing so good. Y'all are doing so good. You need a bath. You look kind of scruffy playing out in the dirt all right I gotta do something even if it's wrong see this Toshiba here got a rated current of uh, 5.9 amps I've got to love that lots huh it's 12 sear I want one that uh, if the power is interrupted it cuts back on by itself so far, I'm leaning toward this one. And look here. My Dia. That's the, um, that's the air conditioner mini split company that I'm looking at. Here's the hmm. 5,000 BTU unit. And it pulls in 4 amps, 454 watts. But of course, it's not cooling there as much. Almost the identical um, watts and, uh, and amps that that Madea Mini Split uses in this 9,000 BTU. So almost double the size of this 5,000. 6,000 BTU unit, 11.1 .1 sear. 536 watts pulls 5 amps the 5000 here has mechanical controls these are electric it has economy see if that 8000's got the economy it's got the economy decisions decisions I like this I can look and see what it's doing anywhere uh, using my uh, AT&T MiFi with my smartphone. I see the temperature. Even if I'm not there, make sure it's working. Well, I ended up getting the 8000 BTU Toshiba. <laughs> that wouldn't fit under there. So I had to have two buggies. I just walked in the middle and pulled them both. All right, let's get these babies in the RV. I gotta go put my buggies up. Don't leave your buggies out where they can roll into people's cars. Just saying. Buy a pretty Volkswagen bus. Use that postal annex to mail off some stickers. Mail off some mail. We got some water, some grapes, some uh, cranberry juice. Heading back to the RV, had them mostly in the shade. But looky, looky, looky. I love CRXs. When's the last time you saw a CRX on the road? This is an 86, 87 model. I had an HF, same body style as that. I got 55 miles to the gallon. It was carbureted and it would fly. They called them pocket rockets. Like I said, I've had four. I bought two as a pair that wasn't running, but I had two that were, were running. I had an automatic, it got 46, and then I had one, I painted it bright chrome canary yellow, just like this. 55 miles to the gallon, 
driving it all she'd go. But yet today they got to make a, a, put the technology of the space shuttle in one and batteries and all kind of electric motors and all that in it. If they really cared about fuel mileage, they already had it perfected back in, they already had it perfected. That car right there, I think I put 200,000 miles on mine before I sold it. Good cars. Make a good tow vehicle, I'll tell you that. And I was driving that when uh, gas was a dollar a gallon, so it didn't cost nothing to drive. And the air conditioner frees you out. All right. It's just my day. I use this compartment. Don't roll away now. I use this compartment right here just for water. I think it'll hold 10 or 12. I hear you, baby May Mays. I'm coming. So that'll hold 12 perfectly. It won't hold 12. It won't hold 12 in a sip of water. It'll hold, it'll hold 12 gallons and that's it. Handy dandy. I love having all this storage. I'm finding it pretty easy to camp any, just about anywhere I want to go. I was just showing you uh, my water storage. Uh, I got a group text from the tribe. Looks like Randy has lost his little, uh, his older trailer that uh, my friends uh, in Montrose got him. It's so horrible. But I, I believe he's okay and I believe he got his truck disconnected. All right, well, I picked up the new window air conditioner. We found that cool Volkswagen bus. And even a CRX pocket rocket blast from the past. But uh, I'm gonna get this window unit put in here, cool off a little bit, and uh, figure out what and how I'm gonna use it. If I'm gonna install it permanently, I'm going to put it through its paces with my solar and just see how it does and go from there. But the video is running long, so I'm going to end it right here. I appreciate each and every one of you. Thank you guys so much for watching my videos. Hey, we'll see you again soon. You guys take care. If you haven't uh, subscribed to my channel, please subscribe. If you like my video, please give me the thumbs up. All right, gotta go. See you next time. Appreciate you. I love you too, Tuck. You're a good boy. You're a good boy. Look at that, look at that toothy grin. Wouldn't take $10 million for you. Or a nickel. You ain't funny. <laughs>